Ayo, hey duckies, Andy Lip here, back with another stream about video, and I want to show you this, it's awesome. I actually got requested on my channel over at Twitch, if you want to make sure you do come and follow over there, I do tons of stuff like this live, so you can learn a lot over there. Uh, got asked, can you actually do a welcome message for somebody that is actually the first time chatter? So, literally the first time they have ever spoken inside of your channel, not just per stream, but ever. You know how normally you get the little message up that, that it says in the chat, first time chatter. We can actually utilize this information using Streamerbot to do a welcome message on screen, do fireworks, do whatever you want. It's super cool. Let's get into it. Put your rock over the stone. This portion of the video is sponsored by Own.TV. Own.TV are literally your one-stop shop for all things streaming. They've got tons and tons of overlays and alert packages. You can get all your different sub emotes and also badges. Anything that you need for your stream is available on Own.TV. And what's even better is that you can save yourself a cheeky 50% off anything using offer code Andy50. I'll leave all the links in the description. Thank you Own.TV for sponsoring sponsoring this portion of the video. So setting this up, it's super cool. It's nice to welcome all the new people into your streamer and show them exactly what you're made of. So I've created a blank scene in OBS just here with a, just a normal text source, as you can see, just there that is ready to go. It's up to you what you do with this. You don't have to just use a text source. You can use animations, completely up to you, GIFs. Literally use your imagination on how you want to welcome your viewers. Now we can jump into Streamerbot. So opening Streamerbot, we can cr start creating some actions. Eagle-eyed viewers, you'll see these. If you want early access, make sure you do join Patreon. So we're going to add a new action just here. And I'm going to call it Twitch chat message. In my previous video on doing multiple different triggers, if you go to platforms and you can see all the different triggers that we can do just here, we can only select one action. The one that we're going to be using is chat message just here, okay? So I'm going to select that and do Twitch chat message. This means anything that we add to actions inside Twitch chat message, it will run every time that that chat message happens. So that means you can run different actions for that one single trigger, even though it looks like you can only use one if that makes sense. If you want to see a full tutorial on it, check it out just up there. I will add it in and in the description. We can leave that for now and we're going to create the actual animation. So I'm going to create another action and we're going to call this uh, first ever chatter because we need a second action to trigger. So basically the first one that's going to trigger is this Twitch chat message and then from there is going to check to see if this is a new first time chatter and then trigger the first time chatter event. So I'm going to set up the first ever chatter by adding a sub action and this is where we create the animation or whatever we want to do. So I'm keeping it basic for tutorial and just using the text source and we're going to edit the the text source first ever chatter so i'm going to type in just here i'm going to do percent user percent because we're using the username there and i'm going to do a welcome to the channel for the first time again you can do anything you want so i'm going to press ok just there and that is now ready to go which is awesome if we now go back to the twitch chat message that we created earlier you might already have one set up we're gonna do a little thing to pull the information so if we go to uh, twitch we're gonna pull the user information and the source is going to be from the user so whoever literally uses this command which is any text source so we're going to get all the information about that user so we're going to then right click and we're going to add a sub action and we're going to create a logic so we're going to go for an if else statement the variable that we're going to use to check it is just first message just like so all lowercase first and message with the capital m and we're going to say equals true so if it is their first message, then the action that we're going to run is first ever chatter. And then we can just uh, tell it to break afterwards if you don't want it to activate any of your other commands or anything like that. And press OK. And now what's going to happen, because we've already set this up to go to the Twitch chat message, Twitch chat message is going to trigger, which then if it's your first ever message in the chat, which it's not mine, so if I just type anything in there, it's not going to say anything. So it's a bit hard to demonstrate. But if I go back into Streamerbot and edit this, if first message equals the opposite, which is false, I could do, or I could change equals to not equals true, press OK. And then now when I test, you'll see, it'll say Andy Lip, 
Andy Lippy, I can't even say my own name. Welcome to the channel for the first time. So we definitely know it does work. So change that back to equals true, press OK, and that is it. Anytime somebody new comes into your chat, it will give them a nice little greeting. You can send an automated message in chat. You can do whatever you want to trigger and make it really special for him. Hopefully you've learned something. If you have, make sure you do subscribe. I'm doing this sort of content a lot whilst I'm building my overlay. If you want to see this stuff live as well, come and see me over at twitch.tv forward slash Andy Lippy. Big huge shout out to all these people that help me make this content full time. If you want to help me make this content full time, then please consider joining Patreon or YouTube channel members from literally one pound a month. It goes a long way to supporting me and this free content for you, all right? And check out one of these StreamerBot videos. It will help you out massively. Put your rock over the stone, and I'll see you in the next one.